Good afternoon, manufacturing all-stars, and welcome to this episode of Manufacturing Happy Hour. Today, you are going to learn how to get a strain gauge signal directly to your controller. We're coming at you live from Automation Fair 2018 in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, where I'm joined by Joe Wilhelm from Helm Instrument. Welcome to the show, Joe. Thanks, Chris. So let's paint it, you know, let's get some context. You know, who is Helm Instrument? Um, just so we know about the solution that we're going to talk about next. So Helm Instrument is a family-owned company. Um, mm -hmm. We were established 56 years ago by my grandfather, actually. Cool. And um, one of the things he developed was a way to monitor force on a machine. Yeah, this is a great niche topic to be because to be honest, we I've never dove into like the strain gauge input modules before. Right. You know, tell us how this works a little bit. So what we do is we'll put our sensors around a machine, and as the machine's operating, we take that load cell signal and we tie it into a PLC input card that we developed for Rockwell, mm -hmm. Alan Bradley. So let's you know maybe paint a quick picture, an application where this is helping measure those tolerances, like let's say at an equipment manufacturer. How does this make an impact to their operation? So this makes an impact because it allows for seamless integration from a load cell into the PLC directly. Um, setting up is a lot easier. Um, and what it does is allows you to set high alarms and low alarms within the PLC. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah. I dig it. What I'm going to do is like a call to action to this video is I'm going to make sure to link up to Helm Instrument below this so that way you can easily access it. In the meantime, Joe, I really appreciate you having on the show today. All right. Thanks, Chris. Appreciate no problem. It. And for those of you out there, stay innovative, stay thirsty, and we'll see you again here on Manufacturing Happy Hour real soon. Cheers.